It went down with normal machine gun fire. <laughs> okay. Oh, they go down with your pistol, so. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's, For some reason, takes... I, I think back in the early alpha, they, they took forever to kill with just normal. You needed, like, grenades or something. Okay, I prefer mm. this down here for the circuit production, actually, then. Yum, yum, grenades. <laughs> One, two, three, four. So let me reset that back up there. Uh, and then the red science needs three. One, two. Uh, I'm sure one iron plate. Oh, there's plenty of it now. <laughs> I think, I think got one. No, I got more than one. Oh, I'm more. Th I'm, Wait, where did my iron plate go? So one gear factory feeds two red science. So if we put this... Hmm. Which direction do you plan on actually taking that main bus of uh, battle? We're kind of constrained here unless we go east underneath the boilers and expand east that way. Um, I didn't actually think of that. Because, <laughs> yeah, the uh, south is a lake and the north is a lake, so... Well, if we take it down south and then... Oh, then again, that won't get three or four... I was going to say, it's just as uh, easy to go under the boilers. Probably. Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably go under them and then probably under another set as well. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so what I'm going to do then is I'm going to make the red. Uh, I'm going to split off iron right above where we are then. Take some ammo. Take the rest of that ammo that's okay. in the chest. Okay, good idea. <laughs> this will be right. gears. This will be red. Okay, and the nice thing about this is, actually, we move this over one. So we've got the copper smelting here. Whoever's singing is doing a really good job of that song. <laughs> <laughs> Right, so the miners are constantly going right now. We are backed up. Good. And, you know, one, one side's backed up, the other side's getting there. <sighs> I feel like I've achieved something. Wouldn't it be... Hmm. Wouldn't it be easier to have one for each... Then again, it's one per one for one, isn't it? Well, no, it's uh, one gear f can feed three or four red science. Yeah, that's because of the speed of the gear production versus the speed of, speed of the um, five. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I normally go two for one, and I just that gives me a source of extra gears just for personal use as well. You watch me rebuild it later. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm just trying to get some initial red up there so yeah. I don't have to keep handcrafting these red. Yeah, take forever. <laughs> All right. Speaking of which, so we have... researching anything again. Um, Yay. Walls. I have enough red science to research walls. Okay. Um, I still have to get the copper here. That's fine. Um, so if we split the iron... We have some here. initial... We have some initial long arm inserters in. Um, the good news about this setup, when you put them next to each other, is the uh, power poles will actually reach. Yeah. Which yeah. is absolutely brilliant. I'll put you there. Oh, I'm out of those as well. Which means I need copper. I didn't want to. Didn't want that much, but hey ho, I'll have that much because I need to make belt. Yeah, the reason why I use electric here is otherwise you're going to use far too much coal, and we've obviously got to have some coal for yeah. later on. Yeah, I mean we're going to need it for the carbon for the stage two. 
Good thing about that is the coal's right next to water. Yeah. Yeah. So if you want to do stage two down near where the coal was, and then belt it up, that way we've got we'll have a belt full. I don't know. Just just an idea. <laughs> I'll, I'll throw out crazy ideas. That's, uh, I think, in the one that I was just playing, that's what I was doing with a lot of my medals, is building it right at this. Now, in this one that I was doing uh, just a few minutes ago, actually, I built the carbon right off of the power. I used the same line uh, right up here near the um, power, but that's just because of where I was building the, uh, the rest of the stages. You know what I've just done as a stupid thing? I'll start crafting belt and uh, guess what we've got being crafted? Yeah, <laughs> I just grabbed some of it. <laughs> I, I, I can guess what you're thinking. Oh, what was it somebody called me once? I'm a dildog. <laughs> okay, I think this will work. That's as far as we need it. Oh. Darn, I think I might have to bring this down just a little bit. Uh, yes, yes. Because I need you to go there, there, and up and down. Yeah, excellent. See so if that does that, hopefully. If I'm going to go straight up and round, this is me in the concentration phase now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm in the same thing, which is why I went quiet. So we've got to get the copper. I think we'll do it through that way. So basically, there. I would normally use a splitter, but that's probably not a good idea. Dear. I don't like using splitters to split the copper. I know, I'm, I'm just jabbering now. <laughs> okay, I got that set up. Okay, let's see what uh, you don't like the splitters to split copper. I'm doing it the same setup as the iron instead yep. of splitting it into two ways, because otherwise you're not going to get enough throughput on either side. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it's going to come out. It's going to come downwards and then next to, next to the corner, ch -ch 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 -ch. yeah, that's what I was thinking around that area. Put put it one off the coal. If if you put it, oh nope, the factory gets in the way. Never mind. So say if you put uh, it one off the coal, I don't have to do anything fancy to get it up. Like that, I could put it there while I've just stuck the underground. Yeah. Okay, that'll work. And then what I'll do is I can uh, take my underground here, take a splitter here. Two mines, that's two great mines think alike, eh? <laughs> and, um, well, shoot. I need uh, underground. Yeah, I need, I need a bit of that too. I've got plenty of it. What does underground need? I think it's plate and transport belt. Belt and, yeah, that's it. Okay, Excellent. The copper will come up there. Do underground here. I'm not going to tell you what I'm doing now. <laughs> Can you guess yet? Oops. If I put that there and put that there, can you tell what I'm going to make? Above, above, what takes the track transporter belts? I forget. Oh, yeah, there you go. But I need the iron that's here as well, so extra iron. And... <sighs> I'm gonna have to do that, aren't I? It's a bit of a mess, okay, but once we get the copper here, we have red science automated. Let me just get these underground yeah, sorted. That's and then fine. I'll... I'm gonna just steal some copper. Oh, we got uh, everything out of full over. <laughs> Let me go get that. Then I'm just gonna grab all the copper plates out of Ooh. the uh, thing and force feed some factories if... so we get them. I'm just gonna pick up two of them because they're both out of okay. coal. 
so might as well might as well not keep you wasting the coal. Right. No, it doesn't. If they're yeah, it doesn't waste it. It just stops. It doesn't consume coal when it's not in operation. Then we've got a. Oops. I guess I probably should have put the stone bricks in a chest if I wanted to continue making more. <laughs> <laughs> that might help. <laughs> I got we've got a hundred stone bricks. <laughs> Already. Yeah. Wow. I'm gonna limit it to about 500. Alright, I have a few more of these. I'm just. Yep, there's your first hour, I guess. <laughs> yep, yep, that's the first. <laughs> in two minutes. Or two seconds. Yeah, I've set the auto save for every hour, so it's like an alarm bell. Yep. <laughs> okay, um. Okay, oh, copper. I'm going to take uh, most of the copper. I'm going to take about three quarters of this copper. Yeah. Oh, my axe broke. And I can't make anything yet because I'm making something else. <laughs> <sighs> okay, and I'm going to force feed these factories <clears throat> until the copper gets... Uh, up there, that'll give us our red science. I'll put some copper in one. Yeah. What? Well, what? Well, I'm not going to use from now on. Right. So, uh, copper will be with us very, very, very shortly. Okay. So red science is otherwise automated, and the, the laboratories are. Operational automatically. Right. So we need to do that, do that, do that. And there's the copper. It might not be running 100% yet, we don't have all yeah, of the... That's, yeah. yeah, that's fine. We don't use copper nearly as much as uh, the iron at this stage, so... Yeah, it's backed up quite nicely back here. Okay, we're getting our first pollution incursion on the uh, northeast side. Still nothing to our south at all. That's good, because it's desert, and I hate desert. <laughs> pollution just pollution just flies through does it yep. right so we could in theory but that would take a lot of war depends which way they're going to attack as well uh, right now it looks like uh, any attack is going to come from the north so uh, mm -hmm. I will go ahead and get the wall started now we did research walls I think uh, yeah we've researched walls so I'll go ahead and get the production of that started Okay, I'm, 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 I'm going to be the one that uh, oh, sets us up on uh, this block. Why can't I build those? Because I have no copper. Why don't I have copper? Because I got rid of it. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. Let's make a load of you. Two. And, okay, I have just enough to make a wall dedicated to construction here. Right, the copper's coming through. Okay. Not a huge amount, but yeah, that's fine. it'll do. And I want three inserters on a chest, I think, to go with it. And I know that you're building there. You're building the for the electronic boards. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Were the first electronic boards really made of wood? Uh, yeah, actually <laughs> they were. All oh, right. You learn something every day. I've worked with some of the uh, uh, 1950s era uh, electronic cards. 
Oh, that, no. That's how old some of the uh, equipment on our aircraft was when I first joined the Air Force. <laughs> okay, there's that, there's that. Should be, they should both feed that. Bit of a different setup to what your viewers are probably used to, but it works. I know when you do it with your copy, you need, I think you do about five five to ten copper outputs, don't you? Yeah, because of the, the lower... I, I, I build mine, everything scales up from an initial thing, so even my iron, I, I usually use it like five to eight iron. Yeah. Uh, and about two-thirds of that, maybe half to two-thirds of that for copper. And I'll tell I you this. scale it up as I go along. <laughs> Good thing about this is it's future proof. I mean, that's why I build it like this. Mm -hmm. It makes it future proof. Although, <laughs> saying that, I think when I built one of my factories, I had two two of these copper smelters, and they still couldn't keep up with what I was producing. I, I believe it. Yeah, I've seen some of the uh, sizes of the, the these factories. Yeah. Okay. Um, wall production has started. Hey, uh, and we have turrets. Okay, and we have, uh, let's see, first paved area, I'm going to go the north-south from the coal, where we're running down to get coal and stone, but since we don't have to go all the way, I'm not going to pave it all the way. A little bit of a danger coming on the, well, not coming on the map, uh, the pollution spreading over to the east with that big biter base. Just got to be careful of that one because they could send out quite a large one. Yeah, the northeast. Yeah, but as I said yeah. we actually have pollution encroaching on one of those bases up there in the uh, northeast, one of the smaller yeah. ones. Well, we have ammo there. for it. We have the ammo. Okay, since we've got the copper here, I'm going to split the copper right away, right here, and we will get the basic circuits done. Just come along the coal line. And split. Have we researched steel yet? Do you want to research that and I'll Sounds feed? Good. I'll get started on steel output, uh, which doesn't need to be as large as what I've been doing. I normally do about half of one of these iron and copper smelters that I do. So about 10. Okay, so we have uh, copper coming in here for copper cable. We have uh, this one will be the circuit boards. This will be the wood, and this will be the and and the nice thing about this the, with the copper coming in like this actually is I can mirror this. If we need to double our basic electronic, all I have to do is run the copper up along the coal and mirror this setup here, and we can double our uh, basic circuit card production. That's brilliant news. <laughs> Actually, like, it, it, this is, doesn't seem to be as compact as when we did our little practice run. It seems to be a bit more open, mm -hmm. even though we had less water on the other one that we did. I didn't turn the water down on this, so it's uh, all normal, apart from frequent enemy bases. I think the rest of it's all normal. I didn't change the iron didn't change the copper or anything. Uh, do, 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 do. Plenty of iron. And just there. Ugh, I'm running into you. <laughs> take the wood out of this chest. Put it in this chest over here. I'm going to leave a small amount of wood, actually. Yeah. Right, we've nearly got two stacks. We've nearly got two stacks of underground belt. Nice. <laughs> so we've nearly got that. We've got the two stacks, two stacks of iron gear wheels. We have nearly two stacks of belt, and we nearly have two, two stacks of underground belt. The splitters require. Transport belt, iron plates, and basic circuit boards. 
and I'm not going to use that. So. And plenty of wood. <laughs> yeah, plenty of wood. For now. It'll go quick, especially. Uh, we'll need to start doing resin here at some point as well, and that'll eat up some wood as well. Let us have lights. Oh, we're going to do that. Go ahead and pick up this uh, old copper mine, I think. Furnace. Mm. Furnace, furnace. I need a furnace, actually. Yep. I have. You have? I have, okay. no, I have no stone. There's stone over here in this chest next to the. Oh, of course there is. Uh, plenty of it, yes. I'll do. I mean, yeah, every time I go down there, I try to remember to bring it, bring the excess back for that purpose. Because we'll need it for rails. I don't think we'll be building rails down there once we get to that point. Rails with them things. <laughs> <laughs> you swore at me, you said rails. <laughs> so I've never done rails in my life. Uh, that, 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 my, my factorial I, life, should I say. I, I, I thought you said you had. <laughs> no, um, uh, I, I, I was going to and then decided against it. Uh, <laughs> I've just started using rails myself, so uh, I, I've, I've played with them on and off. But that, that last set of playthroughs, both the vanilla and the uh, bobs that uh, I'm running on Twitch, is uh, uh, oh, just as fast, is uh, starting to actually make use of rails, especially for the the uh, oil being so far away. I'm using the rails to actually pump. Uh, or, or yeah, bring the oil in via an oil rail tanker. Yeah, which is also another mod. Yeah, we have it. We have it. Yay. It's mods galore. Right, if I do that, bring you over here. And trouble this with long reaches. You think you can scroll Slow. pretty easy. Yeah. yeah. I need longer reach sometimes though. Um, for this session, uh, probably not. This is more of a, uh, we're testing it out. Um, at some point I will have a, uh, a general hosted, uh, playthrough, um, uh, if you're interested. Had somebody, uh, out in the channel asking if they could join. Yeah, that's fun. Um, yeah, also it's running via my computer and yeah. I, I I don't have exactly a new computer. Yeah, we're not set up for a uh, large multiplayer no. today. No, nowhere near. <laughs> I'll say nowhere near because of not faults. <laughs> I mean, seven days to die, I can just about... I used to be able to get five or six people running on it on my machine, but it struggles now since Alpha 12 Plus. Uh, it struggles getting two or three. So it just shows it shows the difference between alphas, but we're not playing that. So, <laughs> but uh, stay tuned. Uh, I've had a couple people from the channel ask if, uh, about a multiplayer, so I will have a general uh, multiplayer hosted. I'm not sure how many people we can comfortably uh, run in a game. Um, in general, uh, four is the most I've seen. Um, with any kind of stability, but I will be doing one here in the future, so stay tuned. Okay, hey, we have uh, 50 basic circuit cards. We have research. Oh, yeah, I was going to add a couple more laboratories. That's what I was going to do. We will be having steel very, very shortly. Do we have armor person rounds yet? Uh, no, um, we need green science. Oh, yeah, of course we do. I am, I am doing a uh, bullet, uh, bullet damage upgrade because we don't have that yet. That's handy, especially now the pollution has really hit over there, yep. onto that northeast. Oh, look at the enemies all up north. northwest as well. Yeah, look at all the enemies up north compared to down south. Yeah, <laughs> zero down south. Oh, what is that? A big tin deposit down south southwest. Is that tin or iron? Um, That's tin. It's tin. 
<laughs> Definitely it, it's, There's a mod out there, I need to test it, uh, that has recolored the um, ores a little bit. I don't know if it's been tailored for uh, a multi-ore mod or not. If not, I might go and just do my own. That should be a fairly simple mod to do. I'll test it with you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, we have one doing one doing steel. Wow. We need. I'll, I'll let you have one guess what we need. What I need. Um, Begins with our I, I and ends in Rob. With an N. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Twenty. Twenty. 5, 10, 20, yes. I should have grabbed some of those basic circuit cards. I just spent the last 45 seconds or so building circuit cards for a research facility, and uh, we have circuit <coughs> cards now. I'm just, I'm just building them out of my hand to make inserters. Yay! <sighs> Okay, we just doubled our science uh, our research capacity. Ooh, four. Yeah. Uh, uh, we uh, have that little bit, this tiny little bit down here, a little bit of steel. steel. That's it, that's all, that's all, all, all we have currently. But that is going to change very, very shortly. We're running at about 75, 80% power again. Already? Mm -hmm. Jeez. Uh, I might set up a second uh, thingy, thingy my job, what's it? Okay, uh, let me <coughs> go ahead and... Uh, let me just finish this steel off and then I'll get the power sorted. That's better, we've got some steel now. <laughs> going to go ahead and set the iron under the steam engines so we can uh, plan the second row out there. Yeah. And extend, uh, I can extend the copper that way as far as that goes. When I normally hit about 80-90% of power, I generally get another one up and running. Yeah. Right. That's about what I generally keep an eye on. There you go, you go back there, you go there. Copy there. Excellent. I sound like Mr. Burns now. Excellent, Smithers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there's a. Uh, I can actually back that up one. Yeah, the closer they are, the easier yeah. it is for me. Yeah. So there's only a two space. The, the output and input of the uh, uh, undergrounds. Yeah. So there's two spaces oh. in between. And then I will set the iron up, or the copper, to go through as well. Steel is now running properly. I've just picked up a load. 96 of it already. Ooh. A little freeze that normally happens every now and again. Uh, iron. Bleeding iron. Ten. Okay, there is our uh, copper and iron to continue on to that in that direction. Should I build a couple turrets? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, why not? Just in case. I'm half surprised uh, we haven't had a... Uh, anything come through yet. Grab some How much ammo. Ammo. Is there. Wow, 341 ammo. So I'll build like three turrets and put... Let's see, uh, attack is going to come from that side, it's going to probably come from that side of the lake. Yeah, it's just depending whether they go down the lake or round the lake. Yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put two turrets on each side, uh, one by the uh, actual smelters, because yeah. the smelters are often a uh, 
and uh, one to the east of the uh, laboratories. That covers pretty much both directions. Oops. Right, that's our second line. You watch me run out of iron. No? <laughs> <laughs> Luckily, no. Luckily, oh, incoming! Yep, incoming! I happen to be right there. <laughs> I just saw him running down. <laughs> they must have come from up north, of, northeast. So they went round. That's what the other two turrets were for, so... Sneaky little barstools. So, yes... Uh, iron, that's what I was after. Iron. Again. <laughs> Why would you ever need iron? I don't know. Don't need iron at all. That's just a silly comment. <laughs> I'm still getting used to the pipes as well. Uh, what's the bigger pipe? It's the stone. Stone pipes are the biggest. But you don't need stone pipes for this, you just need the plain iron. Copper is mainly used for oil. The stone would be used for gas, as I'm guessing. Yeah. That would be uh, the most likely use for that. There and build me some pipe. Oh, built myself too much pipe now. Oh, we have a gun attacking. Yep. Um, no, we need to the ones to the east because uh, I don't see any dead bodies up here. Can you? That's where. That's where the. Was it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no bodies. There you go. And that's that's them feeding themselves. Nom Good. nom nom. I love it. It's like a Mexican wave. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> go wave, my pretties. <laughs> I just think it looks so cool when they're all just waving at once. <laughs> It's great when you get about five of them and you've just got this constant Mexican wave going from back to front, but diagonally. Yeah, let's add a, uh, the, the, the uh, advanced, uh, the, the combina combinatorial uh, things and we can make all sorts of pretty things happen with them. Yeah. Ooh. I have to re-learn re re all of my electronics jargon for figuring out what I want to do with them, but... Cramp in the foot, that's horrible. <laughs> that's probably about the worst. It's hard to stretch that. Ooh, what's happened to a coal? Um, uh, might have to make some more mining jewels, I'll sort that out. Um, I'm on it. Okay. Yeah, it must just be uh, the extra throughput. Yeah. I don't blame I don't it though, Google. Any, I don't see anything unusual, no breaks or anything. Okay, uh, oh, research, research. I was looking at research. Steel armor. That's a nice Ooh, yes, please. one. <laughs> I've got some steel, actually. I haven't picked that uh, up yet, but I don't need it yet. Uh, let's see, how are we doing on... Uh, we've got almost 200 basic electric, electric boards, or basic... What are they? Circuit boards. And they really need to change the name slightly because they're basic circuit board, basic electronic board, <laughs> basic electric board. Right. Please power up. Oh, yes. Ha 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 ha. That's another four placed. That should keep it going. I love these paths. About 40% power usage, so that's good. Oh, yeah. Um, 
No, it's just a path there. Yeah. I, I'm going to go grab some more brick and add some more. Uh, and grab the rest of the stone that's down here, too. And the walls. Might as well grab the walls while I'm down here. Yeah, protect those turrets. Yeah. Walls, brick, and where's the wall stone? stone. We only have 1,600 stone down here. <laughs> only. I don't know what you need stone for. It's not like iron. Don't know what it's uh, for. You'll you'll need it for the the rails. Yeah, need it for the rails is what you'll need the raw stone for, uh, as well as some of the buildings. Although we were getting away from needing raw stone for buildings for the most part. Uh, that's another couple hundred brick. All right, we shouldn't once we've upgraded the steam engines and boilers, we shouldn't need any more mm -hmm. for a long time. So I've just made a little bracket in the... <laughs> looks yes, like a little bracket. Yes. <laughs> right. We're doing the next two uh, labs as well. Okay, walls. Come on, Cole, don't let me down. An attack there in the northeast again. Or the north oh. central. Yeah. It looks like that's going to be the main focus of their attack, so that's where I'm going to wall off first then. I don't know why I've just done that. Oh well. Now I'm handcrafting stuff that I don't need to. <laughs> We all do it. Oh, I think we, 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 we can fix you of that. They have a mod that allows no handcrafting at all. That's just cheating. Well, it depends, though. <laughs> think about it. Yeah. Yeah, you, <laughs> that wouldn't work. <laughs> uh, it, it can work. Um, I, I think it was a Roomba that tried did the first playthrough with he it wasn't with the mod he just it was a conscious decision after the very first uh pick i'm just extending the science by two uh, I, yeah I, I had two here ready to do that so might as well buy go by four <laughs> let's double it that's my other one and Oops, that doesn't work when you put it the wrong way. I've got the longs. Uh, I guess we only need the one there. Okay. There we go. Yay. Double green. Yay. Uh, what did we... Oh, armor. We can do steel armor now. Uh, can I make steel armor? As in, have I got the heavy armor? I need lots of copper. I've got the steel. Well, i got to go grab some steel. How much does it take? 50 or something like that? Yeah, it's, it's not that much. I say it's not that much, it's actually quite a bit. It's more than I have, how's that? Was <laughs> <laughs> that zero? Was, was that yeah, zero? zero. <laughs> <laughs> but steel's backed up. Yeah. It's going to come out of... Ooh, I'm, I'm, I missed, I missed a, uh, an, an inserter. How dare I? So we're making ten steel every. Uh, I think it takes five seconds to craft, doesn't it? Um, the, in these furnaces, it probably sounds about right. We're doing uh, eighty-four a minute. <laughs> seven, seven seconds. What an odd number. <laughs> came up with that number anyway. Okay, steel armor happily worn. Um, I did one more uh, 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 bullet, bullet speed while I take a look at what we need for green. Because we need to start looking at green science, which is tin, lead. Yeah, so anything armor. else? You, I'll let you sort that out because you're good at that. So <laughs> in here. 
I'm the just... lead is down. Where's the lead? I'm just thinking. Uh, oh, lead is down. Is that lead down there to the southwest? Is that our nearest lead? No, uh, near the coal, yeah. West of the coal down there? Okay, so yeah. the tin's easy. It's just the lead. Wait, I think the tin is easy. Where's the tin? <laughs> On the other side of the lake. This is quartz, not tin. So both of them will have to come in from the far side of the lake. That's yeah. over there. Yeah. Okay. Tins on tins on the other side of the lake. And you got okay. The lead. Not a big deal. Um, just need uh, another ton of transport belt. Uh, I need copper for once, and iron for uh, once. Do, 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 do. How many of those can I make? Seven. Yeah, let's do it. Those furnaces, or the, the coal here. I'm gonna tap off of that. I'm gonna I'm gonna have a uh, kind of mixed production line of lead, tin, lead and tin here on the west side of the main smelter. I'm gonna Incoming just belt, attack. belt the. Yeah, I see it. Belt the uh, the guns will take care of it. It's only three of them. It looks like. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> <laughs> I have to do that. Test out your gun. Yeah. Okay, so that's a chemical furnace. Uh, stone furnace. Yeah, that's what we'll need. Do I have... Yeah, I do have stone furnace. So, what we'll do is right around here. Oh, let's put it in there. So I can put that in there. I am now going up here. And the good thing about autofill is it puts ammo in for you. Yes. So I'm going up here to go kill some bad guys. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to tell you how, I'm just going to kill them. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Your bullets just got faster. How's that? I'm not shooting them. Ah. Oh, grenades? No. No? Turrets. Ah, turrets, yeah. Turret creeping. So this is... This is bauxite. Oh, here. bauxite, not gold. Okay, that, so that's the aluminium. Uh, which means... Oh, hey, we found our first uh, south enemies. Have we? Oh, there, yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll see him. This is that with. Is that? Lead. One of these is gold. I'm going to go look. Lead. Lead. Something else right next to it. And copper. Oh, nice. Hmm. Right, so I have a damaged turret, which which is bad. I just, can, I, can I repay, please? Um, please. Thank you. Right, so I've killed them there. It's this base to the uh, east of that, which is... No, it's, it's the west. I've got to go west. It's creeping up quite uh, quite a way over to the west. Let me just uh, pick up the camp. That western um, uh, northwest is also bauxite. But even further to the northwest, there is... Uh, is that iron? Iron and... I'm not sure what that is. Tungsten? Maybe? Brown stuff. <laughs> I'll just call it the brown stuff. <laughs> yeah. I think it's tungsten, but I'm not sure. So, well, no, no gold for us. Yeah. Oh. No. Oh. Or silver. Okay. No, I think on a, I think on a practice one, I think we found some silver, didn't we? But it was only yeah. a really small amount. Yeah. Uh, actually, it was a pretty fair size pack. I don't know how much was in it. I didn't check the richness of it, but it was a uh, it was a patch about two-thirds the size of our starting iron here, I think. Maybe half the size. I don't like where th these enemies are in the trees. Yeah, yeah, that's why I didn't stay up there too long. I just wanted to see what the uh, metal was. 
that I didn't have any turrets or anything with me. Okay, so if I bring the ore up this way... Got it. That was one of those ones that, that some of them actually have a lot more health than normal. Yeah. That one had well, three and a half. At four point nine. So yeah, they're. Now I, I'm not sure if uh, does a multiplayer affect this starting health and things, strength of enemies. I don't know. No, 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 no. Will you go away? Right, that should keep them at bay a little bit. Uh, I am out of ammo, though. I'm out of ammo and I'm out of the belts and I still haven't made it down to the tin. <laughs> <laughs> Here's me attacking and you're sorting out for the green signs. Yeah, we need to at least get the... Uh be able to handcraft one blue factory so we can do the inserters. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> You're running faster than I am. Oh wait, I'm running against the belt. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm running and not getting anywhere? Um, right. Might help if I have the heavy armor on instead of the uh, crappy armor on. Yeah. If you want to... Uh, yeah. You know, stay alive. Let me build myself a couple of repair packs. Put it down on my task toolbar, not my taskbar. That's Windows. <laughs> I'm not sure Windows would like that. <laughs> Just used all of them. Just on three turrets. Now, unfortunately, I'm not going to get power all the way down here, so I'm going to have to just fill up a uh, drill with... <sighs> Oh, I can't do a drill. I don't have stone. Uh, we are current. We're currently consuming 277 iron plates per minute, but we're making 230 odd. That doesn't sound healthy. Yeah, something. Yeah, not quite balanced with that. Where is all our iron being used? We haven't even started making hydrochloric acid yet. I think it's because one side stopped working, so... Oh, that's not good. Why did that happen? Oh, it's because they're all full up with 100, oh. two, 200 yeah. iron. Yeah, that'll do it. Um, what do I need here? Uh, would that do it, though? Hmm. Let's have a look at research, because I'm sure... Yes, there is. I'm going to do that one. Shooting speed. Number two. Just because it's red science, yeah, and it's quite quite it handy. While, yeah, it takes a while too, so it'll be time to get a good chunk of this green done while that's researching. Do you want some good news? Sure. Always. Check to the check to the east, just past those biter bases. Oil. <laughs> yeah, something that you normally struggle with. Yeah, I have. Well, I I am in at least one of the playthroughs. Okay, so we now have tin coming up. And being smelted. Crap. That That's, good. That's the bad news. <laughs> no, I thought I had it. I thought I had enough room for. Uh, I'll make a steel chest. Sod it. Steel chest for the alien parts. Ah. Yes. Right. That's got quite a few in there actually. Forty-one pink. Uh, two green, two blue, three purple. And 38 small blobs, which is small alien signs, yep. which I still don't understand. I think they're from, they're the, got, yep, haven't gotten there, so... I think the small come off the enemy and the normal ones come off the bases. Yeah, yeah, that that much, yeah. And I, uh, they come off the biters in specific. I'm not sure what come off the worms. I think something else comes off the worms. They're classed as buildings, though, because I can't move anywhere. Ah, that's true. Which will explain why. Right. Okay, so Galena is being uncovered. Power's good. Copper's really backed up, which is good. Now, what do we 
do with Herself. this? Do I just bring everything up and then smart insert the dickle out or uh, mine everything? Do I just like I normally do and worry about? I think I'm going to actually just mine it and move it all up and use a smart inserter to separate the iron, the nickel from the uh, lead and then smelt it. If you're going to do that, probably best get two uh, two smart inserters yeah, yeah, just yeah, in I place. Will. Yeah, I will. But I, I just because of the distance away. Mm. I'd yeah, it's quite have, a distance. Yeah, I'd rather have the nickel and and lead all up there in case we lose a drill. We have a ready source of it. So I think that's what I'm going to do this time. It's not how I normally do it. I don't like how far south the pollution's gone compared to up north. <laughs> yeah, well, fortunately, map. we got a big lake there in the southeast, which is going to. Uh, protect us somewhat. I'm just Ugh. trying to think. Do I go after the ones on the west now? We'll start going after the ones on the east because they're about to be hit by the pollution. Uh, get that oil cleared out if you can. Yeah. That's We're a... not going to be able to survive on the oil we have. Well, the one that we covered up nearly. <laughs> go after a few on that side. I have a few repair kits, so I can make more. And, yeah. Okay, now I need about 500 transport belts, and I should <laughs> get the lead. <laughs> 500 transport belts later. Now let's see, I used, about, I, I used close to 200, I think. 250, I think, for the tin. I do believe. So I came back and emptied the chest twice. Ooh. Go away. Haha, you died. <laughs> oh, no, I know, I get so much enjoyment out of killing them. <laughs> Six. Six turrets were under attack. I'm going to do it on this side. You know what? Perfect, actually. Actually, that looks like it could be absolutely perfect if I do that. We're under attack, we're under attack. <laughs> Yeah, that's me attacking. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. There's lots of things dying. Mm -hmm. I couldn't have planned that any more perfect if I tried. They're not using a lot of ammo. I thought they'd use a lot more. Well, there's 145, and I'm only about halfway there. So yeah, 300 transport belt. <laughs> Okay, what I can do up here is... Oh, we don't have smart inserters yet. Okay. Now that'll be the next thing we do. Research, I guess. As soon as we can. I might not be able to. Because of this big bite of the one that's got the big health, I'm having a little issue. Yep. Just a second. Let me... Uh... Make myself a couple turrets, I'll come out as well. Uh, turret. Three come on, that's it. Got it. Got it? Okay. <sighs> come on, what you come? Come back down here. <sighs> that, that was hairy. <laughs> What was it, a big base? It was one of those three and a half thousand health bases. Yeah. On the wrong side of this lake here. But I'm about out of ammo. Yeah, 
I've got a hundred or so odd with me. Plus the hundred personal ammo, so I've got two hundred ammo on me. I'll bring them up. I got three turrets. Oh, I'm pulling back. I've got no ammo. Go go west. I'll I'll cover. They can blow them turrets up now. <laughs> There's a Jesus. Big <laughs> worms. Ah, that's one of the big ones because of the colour of it. Ugh, ugh. Oof. I've got another turret in here somewhere. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Totally. I can make two more rounds. Yeah, we need... Uh, can you make a chest? I can dump cap my ammo. I can. Yeah. I've got to pick up all the candy floss. Oh, hello. No, uh, mummy. I'm out of uh, turret ammo uh, because it all went into my. Oh, I've got cleared it. Take those two, that's uh, I'll take the chest as well. There is one more base just slightly to the west. Yeah, see so yeah. uh. That's it, we got it. We cleared okay. it. Good job. I think Oops, I got what's... your extra turrets. Oh, I need a bit there, a bit there, a bit there. I'm putting random bolt in because apparently that stops him from spawning. Ah, gotcha. There. Supposedly it helps with respawning anyway. Yep. Right, so we've secured hopefully the iron. Battery evolution at 8.4. I'm going to uh, drop the turrets and repair them. Um, I've got a total, I think I picked up five total. I had crafted three, so I'm just going to drop them. Uh, yeah. Two near the research and three up in the... Uh, up where the walled western walled turrets are. And you yeah. can grab whichever ones. Uh, so I'm just going to drop one by the research. I think this flank is pretty solid. <laughs> <laughs> and put all the candy floss in that chest. Blip, 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 blip. Why am I sounding like an alien? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not normal. What's normal? I don't know. Guns well, are all repaired. I'll leave one of them down here and move the others up. I'll take some of those. Nuts. Are you... Yeah, good idea. Keep that one there. Just in case. Yeah. Yay, there goes a Mexican wave again. <laughs> <laughs> We've got plenty of uh, science in there. Yep. Added a few more that I had picked up. 
And then uh, I'm just going to put these four there and they can be grabbed as needed. Just make sure you grab ammo too. Which is still being made. And I'm going to go back to my lead attempt. We might as well just we need, research anything yeah. right now. Uh, I need uh, smart inserters at some point, but I don't think we can actually get those yet. I don't see them on the list. They're not. Handle, they, yeah, I'm just looking oh. to see what we need to get to them. Express. It, electronics. We can do electronics oh, now. Yeah. Just yeah. Okay. I, I knew it was fairly early because I've already <laughs> had it in the other one. Okay, that will allow me to actually separate lead from tin over here, or lead from nickel, I mean. And I was looking at, uh, oh yeah, I needed to go get some stone for another couple of furnaces. That's what I needed. Oh, look at this big thing here. What? This big line. Oh, is that the uh, tin? Um... I don't northern know. one is the tin, the southern one is the lead, nickel. That'd be, that'd be lead then. That's the one I'm working on now. Right, you need an input, so you want a, one of those. You want that. Yeah, that's the tin there. Okay, this one's going to be the lead, but let's see, the lead is going to get separated. I want it near the coal, so this will be good for that. When, um, when they swing around together, it looks like they clash each time. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> there should be some, some sort, sort of clashing of device. Weird mating ritual. <laughs> Okay, a so. machine. The mating ritual of a machine. Pull the coal off there. Now, how am I going to do the... Uh... What's this one going to be? This is this is going to be... I haven't placed it exactly, but this is going to be the, uh, the lead. And I'm going to put it... I want to put it on the same belt as the tin. Yep. So it'll go up there. The input is going to get separated down here because this is where I'm going to separate the nickel from the the lead ore. The lead ore is actually it's easy to do. The lead ore is going to, um, I, you know what? I don't need to separate it. I just need to put it into a chest here, like so. I need some wood. <laughs> First time you've heard me say that. <laughs> We still have a little bit in the chest here for po for power poles. I left a little bit in it, um, and then what am I out? I'm out of iron. It's your turn then. We. This will come out here. I was experimenting there the other day with the different inserters, like the near side and far side. Mm -hmm. Quite interesting. Oops, uh, that won't do. That won't do what I want it to do, though. Um, what I need is the chest right there. This is what's going to separate the the nickel from the um, from the lead. So this will just come over. That separates the nickel from the lead and then the lead's the only thing that'll go in that type of furnace. So that's what automatically does that. And that comes out and under and to the east. So it's made it up with the uh, plain copper and that's uh, just about everything we need for the uh, green. We just need to get the... Um, I need to finish the drill and oh transporter belts that's what i needed and uh carbon and i think that's all we need for the do you want me to look into carbon for you yeah go ahead because i can actually make carbon down here can we make metal mixing chemical furnace right i need some stone bricks and 
I'll shoot should them. be plenty down there. Oh, I don't want that many. Enough <laughs> <laughs> pig with the rest. Me, Pave? <laughs> I am not a peasant. <laughs> Better that than a pheasant. <laughs> well, yeah. That's true. Oh, I wouldn't want to be a pheasant, no. Um, I should be able to finish off the lead belt. Chemical. So the chemical can go... Here. Now I've got to put this right. So if I put you there, you're going to go. Did I just boo boo? Okay. <laughs> Why did I put. Oh. Let's... Ah. Right. I'm going to so double need... the mines down here just so we get a lot up there just in case we lose this early. Uh, and that, that and the coals going to have to be minded periodically. 